Welcome to the World Tarot. This is the series Divine Masculine Diaries for the 13th of June 2023. Holy Spirit, show me what Divine Masculine needs to hear today. The Sun, 27, and the Troll. The Troll is being revealed. He could be a fire sign or she. This person could have Leo, Capricorn, and Sagittarius in their chart, and Aries. All the fire signs and Capricorn. So this person, yeah. I almost said that their soul is created in hell. That sounds kind of poetic. Maybe this person is a poet. Or this person likes drama a lot. 81, this person could be born in 1981 possibly. The 8th of January or the 1st of August could also be significant. 38, somebody could be 38. Or in March, somebody be born in March, August, or January. Okay. So who's the, the little devil here? Is this a female? Is this a little devil female you're dealing with? Quetzalcoatl, 22. Somebody could be from South America. Nine, Sharnabon the Wizard. Somebody could have a nine life path. They could be born in September or on the 9th. 44, the Lunatic. Maybe they're 44. We've got two master numbers here already. This person could be very good at something. 32, the Naughty Bridge. 25 and 5, Leah. 24, King of Swords. And 26, Diana the Fairy. This could be a father and a daughter. This could be another daughter or it's somebody else altogether. It could be that these two people have been attacking this woman and this woman has been sending their energy back to them. Who's Leah? Also, there's another message. It could be a reiteration of the same message I got yesterday that a um, younger person is attacking an older man possibly. Who's Leah, please? It's interesting because we have 24, 25, and 26 here. Something could be happening on those dates, or it could be somebody's birthday. Somebody be born on the 25th, another person on the 24th, and another on the 26th. 38, the Empress of the Fairies. So this is Divine Feminine. I asked, who is Leah? It's the Divine Feminine. So these two, who could be family members. Oh yeah, bang the door. I swear to God, I'm going to call somebody about that and she's gonna get evicted anyway <laughs> this could be a, a father and a daughter working against possibly another daughter or just somebody else altogether and this is the divine feminine okay so this is um return to sender spell this guy's been playing with energy. This older man's been playing with energy. He could be born on the 16th or the 24th. Or he could be 16 years older than you, Divine Feminine. Or 24 years older than you. 10, the Siren. 2, the Hodag. And 11, the Magic Whistle. The authorities are watching somebody as this person wants to take revenge. Also, for this Divine Feminine to send this energy back and for it to hit these two people is justice. This revenge is actually justice. So Divine Feminine is not really doing anything except for catching the energy, catching the chakram here and throwing it back to them. That's all. So that's uh, this could be the outcome of all these people's spell work is that they're going to get hit by it. And this could be happening today or in the next few days. 14 twice. It could be happening tomorrow on the 14th. Also, somebody will be born on the 14th. Somebody born on the 14th will be very mad that this magic is going to backfire on them. There could be two people born on the 14th who are going to be mad that the spell work backfired on them. Somebody be born on the 14th of November. 18, ho oh, oh Also, somebody born on the 18th is going to be very mad because they're going to be burning. 
<clears throat> they're going to be burning with shame. Somebody's going to be burning with shame because they're going to be exposed to the whole world for what they've been doing. The wise old lady, 12, and the kraken. Could be um, a couple, a married couple. An older married couple is going to be shamed. Doesn't have to be older. People could start looking older because of their spell work backfiring too. Or they feel sick. A man and a woman. Could be a fire sign and an earth sign. Free, 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 free. And six. Multiples of free. Eight, Eileen Riff from the Sun. So somebody's going to arrest a couple who have been doing spell work and spiritual warfare and all other kinds of warfare too. 25, the Gargoyle and 33, the Sea Lion. So either this is a father and a daughter or it's a husband and a wife or something like that. They're going to be publicly shamed for their behavior. Death in reverse. The 13th of July, that's exactly a month from now. Something could be happening on the 13th of July. Okay, so what's what have these two been doing? What exactly have they been doing? Temple of Earth in reverse. They tried to dig a hole for somebody else and they're falling into it now. So that's what they've been doing. They've been abusing their power. These people could have a lot of power. Sarah, 15, somebody be born on the 15th. 48, the righteous cold one. Somebody could be born in 48 or could be 48 years old. The righteous cold one makes me think of an authority figure, a police officer or a military person. And she's wearing a uniform too. So this could be a male and a female cop. Or they could be official people. They could be politicians or leaders, the leaders of a company possibly, or a group of some sort. They could be water signs. Maybe they're both water signs or something of the sort. Somebody could be a Capricorn, 31, the troll. These people have been trolling somebody. They have been um, abusing their power. We've got 13 and 31 mirroring numbers here. So something's being mirrored back to them. What they have been doing to somebody else is happening to them, basically. That, that's all I'm getting here. And definitely I'm getting an older man and a younger woman. Doesn't have to be a big age gap, but he's older than her, even if it's just by a few months or years. Anyway, could also be a father and a daughter, like I said before. Yes, it's a father and a daughter for some. A father and a daughter are going to be publicly shamed for doing something, for abusing their power. Somebody could be an air sign too, or an earth sign and an air sign. 23, the Kraken. Somebody's losing their grip. This year, something's ending. They were controlling something. They were trying to block something by using their authority, their connections, their power, spell work. They could have been working with police officers, with military people, with secret services, with the mob, with spellcasters. They could have been working with a whole array of people. And they themselves are very connected to all these other people. They've been using their connections, all of their connections against somebody. And now it's possible that their own connections are going to expose them for what they've been doing. Some of these people could be jumping ship and they could actually be blowing the whistle. 22 Tudor, the, the magic whistle is here. As I just said, they're going to be blowing the whistle. The 22nd of November could be significant. 26th of February, 42, somebody be 42. And the Empress of the Fairies, 38. So there's another couple, possibly, who are also 
authority figures who are going to expose this other couple for what they've been doing. 2021, somebody has been doing this since 2021. Somebody has been secretly stalking somebody, investigating somebody, causing problems for somebody. And now everybody's gonna know what this person or these people have been doing for all these years. Because it could be somebody from their own ranks who are going to expose these people, humiliate them publicly. The tree of life and the magic bag, it could be their own family members or some kind of very rich and powerful group. Could be somebody's youngest son who's gonna expose them, if possible. So yeah, 23, the magic wolf, 2023, something's going to end in 2023 because another person's going to take this down. <sighs> I was also getting the message that a particular website, Amazon specifically, is going to be hacked. I just saw 1111 as I said this. 22 is 11 11 so there could be a particular man who's gonna hack Amazon or this could even be an authority figure the police or the authorities in a particular country could actually be taking Amazon down because they have been abusing their power in some kind of way 40 and 50 27 the Sun and two, Prince Charming. So the authorities are gonna take down Amazon. It might shut down for good, not just in some countries. The Gargoyle 25. It could be in Europe specifically with the Gargoyle here. With the gargoyle and the temple of fire, I'm thinking of the church or some kind of coven. And again, I'm thinking of authority. The authorities are gonna take down this website completely. Possibly because they've been doing something illegal or immoral or both. The youngest son and the empress bee, again, this could be a hacker, could be a Sagittarius or an earth sign. But it could be a hacker who works for the police. Also, that's Robin Hood. That youngest son makes me think of Robin Hood, so it could be a vigilante too. 22 and five cost me. Could be a genius, could be some kind of computer whiz who's gonna take this whole thing down. This person could be operating under the veil. They could also be a secret service agent. Could also be a secret service agent pretending to be a rogue hacker. But I don't think this is rogue. I think this is something organized. It's, it might be made to look like there was a hacker. But this could be a police operation happening here. The devil. That's Capricorn energy. 26 the devil 26 on top of 26 and the lake of fairies 45 this is an international thing amazon might get hacked from multiple countries at the same time or it will get shut down by the authorities in multiple countries at the same time the magic bag for 47, the tree of life, 30, the empress bee, and 35, the youngest son. I don't know if somebody's own family member is going to take down this website. So somebody who works for this website or maybe even owns the website, their website might be taken down by their own family. Doesn't have to be though. But somebody does have money and resources and power. Whoever's taking down this website, 22 Quetzalcoatl, could be somebody from South America, from the Southern Hemisphere, there could be people hacking from the Southern Hemisphere, could be multiple people doing this, 
from different countries in the southern hemisphere. I don't know. Anyway, Amazon is going down. So there's a very posh couple here who could be ordering this. So some high authority figures, some very rich people, could even be people of noble background, are actually going to order for this website to be taken down. So it's their own people who are taking them down. Empress High Priestess in secret. Yeah, so it's going to be uh, kept a secret. Okay. Bye, Amazon. <laughs>